kind of surprised how empty the parking lot is. <coughs> Normally, this is like completely full, but I guess this will be the intro to the Ant Hills update. And uh, look how flat it is. It's like 85 degrees already. And uh, one up. Look how clean the truck is. Okay, we'll get to the boring. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna try to replicate that 2018 video as much as I can, at least as far as like order. So, parked at the mill flat, <clears throat> which is weird. I don't really remember us ever parking here. Maybe like a long time ago. But, uh, ooh, it smells terrible. But here's the, uh, here's the pathway. Whew, that climb. Okay, so I'll do my best. I'm going to show you all the features. Not necessarily going to do all the features because uh, it's a lot of pedaling and I'm not feeling it. So, anyways, okay, I'll be back in a sec. Over the bridge. area with all the blue bonnets where people would take pictures of their children's yep soup's fun okay entrance to the trail Looks like somebody trimmed all the stuff back. Okay, so normally it used to be you go up there, but there's not really any trail up there per se. It's just kind of like Hudson through a field. So this is more of a trail. At least you're not walking, you're not going to the middle of a field. So. I don't know if this has a name or not. I'm not really up to speed on what things are called. But you'll... You'll see that when we get to like where the features are. I know they all have names, but... I'm not cool enough to know. I'm probably already breathing hard. Did I mention it's like 85 degrees already? I like, what is it? Oh, I guess it's eight o'clock now. Mm. Didn't quite make my target of 7 a.m. But whatever. Last place on earth. Great place to begin riding. Getting close to the hail rollers. This will be our first feature of the day. It's been quite a while since I've been here. So for most of the stuff, I'll have to look at it first. Make sure it's still there. Okay. 
tail rollers are a little, they've worked on them, so they've got lips on them. So, you know, they're a little bit bigger than they used to be. Still a good size for a beginner, I suppose. I forgot to lock out my derailleur. Or let me turn on the clutch, whatever. So looking down, it looks like Hail Satan has got a bunch of work done. So I have not been down there in over a year. So we'll go down and see what it looks like. So we go down to Hail Satan. Pretty much blind. I feel like maybe this is I've been seeing a lot of clips from handhills that I wasn't familiar with. And I think that may be what it is. So hopefully it's done well enough that I can figure it out first try. And if not, then Freddy fails and coming. It looks like it hasn't been touched. Oh crap. Should have went up. I guess this is a pipe. Oh, whoa. Hmm. Okay. This is what I've been seeing. That's cool. Interesting. Where does this lead? So we're going to file this under the uh, category of I'm not feeling it. No, this doesn't go anywhere. Oh wait, does it? Okay. Okay, so following that path brought me out right in the middle of the S-berms. So, had to go back around. where that truck's resting away. Okay, so we're gonna try the S-berms. It's definitely been worked on. Let's see, what does that say? Cat Forest was amazing. Cool. Okay, S-berms. Pretty sure you've seen this before. So I'm not pushing because I'm noob status. <sighs> and out of shape status. That's where we used to go. the way I go. Something's making a noise. Hmm. Okay, so we got several parts there like this. They used to have trails, but now it's just flat. I think my pedal is squeaking. Pretty sure that's what that noise is. Okay. 
dropping into I don't know what it used to be called but uh, used to be a fun little back and forth now it's just whoa whoa dipped into the woods nothing here nothing to see here Look at all the new trees that they planted. Some of them are growing pretty well. Not really sure what they did here for flood control. I guess. Oh, I guess this was up higher. And so they just gave the water more places to go. Yep. I know things. Okay. This is the tail end of the trail that's no longer this. Whoa, there's a jump. That's new. It's pretty cool, actually. We shall hit that on the way back. And this might look familiar. Or it might not. I don't know. Very first Ant Hills Trail I rode on. And I crashed. You know, way back when. You know, normally I would go left. Not normally. In the old days, I go left to make that climb. But I don't like it. And my success rate is low. So, take the easy way around. I know. This is going to be the most exciting video ever put on YouTube. I like to go down that, but I'm not going up it. Okay. I don't remember what used to be here. Oh, look, a jump. Nice. Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. We're definitely in two, uh, Adding little little jumps here and there. I think it's been a solid six months since I've been here, maybe. Okay, so it's not my pedal that's squeaking. Okay, we're back to another open area. Don't fully remember what this used to be. And up ahead is where John Francis had built all those all those jumps. They were pretty fun, but they came and bulldozed them. So, okay, I'm gonna turn this off while we pass these people. Just drop in. Okay the jumps that he made. Yeah, this noise is weird. It's kind of noise that I've heard before. Look, like there's a big bird behind me chirping occasionally. Wait, is there a bird behind me? Okay, now we're Derry Ashford. For all the trails. Yeah. Okay. Well, luckily I brought an extra GoPro battery, you know, just in case. Oh, I'm gonna build up a lift there. Conditions are Slightly dry, but not too terrible. It's not really, there's a little bit of powder, but uh, it's not mud. Glad it didn't rain. 
because you know we can't ride in the rain which is why I don't know how to ride in the wet Bypassing roots, not mad at it. I don't know, one of these corners is like one of the funnest little jump lines. You know, when I say little, I do mean little, but you're dropping off the road. So you don't really have to pedal that much. And it's the drop in is right there. If you pedal, you can also just push it into it. Boom, boom, boom. We will be doing this momentarily. Okay, look like a water bottle. It's all dirty already. So this is where we congregate before dropping into the 5 O line. And it's called that because one of the very first or very few times I've been here to help. There's a cop on the other side of the bayou that was like yelling at us so long as we couldn't do what we we're doing. Of course Fefo was there. And uh, he's like, nah dude, we could do this. We got permission. You know what they're talking about, shut the hell up. And the guy got all pissed. And said, we're coming over there. So we uh, waited for him to mosey on. And then we put up the tools and decided just to go ahead and ride. So, not sure if if the police is, we're at the Derry Ashford parking lot waiting for us because you can't really get to drive a car here. And that dude was not hiking anywhere. He was like in a golf cart. So, okay. Trapping, hopefully there's no people walking down there. Which happens quite often. See, pretty sick, minimal. I think I have two pedal strikes, toward, pedal strokes towards the end. Like it's so fun. And I believe we're getting close to Gill's Crack. Which, uh, I should probably hit it now while I'm fresher. Okay, check back in a sec. Okay. So, come you coming from this way, roll, roll, jump, jump. Then you come up to this thing. Seems like it's still good. You launch over another trail, and there's a couple more jumps down there. It's a lot of pedaling. Like, so stupid. But, work with what we got. So. It's fine. This is, I guess, the meeting point at the top. So, idea is pedal a bunch at the beginning, get your speed up, and then it's so dumb you got to pedal in the middle. But again, we do what we, you know, doing the best with what we got. And I say we like I have anything to do with this stuff. Gap one. Pedal, pedal. Oh. Okay. One is deep, one is short, one is to flat. Super smooth. 
fun though. We're in the middle of it. <sighs> Out of breath. So you're gonna breathe with me. Probably remember this thing. Super slippery. Okay. Back to the top. 10 foot climb. Wait, no. 20 foot climb. Can I make it? Now it's 25 feet. It's a good thing I got those big chain rings on my cassette. Oh my God. That was the first. A couple of guys pulled up, taking a breather, and they asked if I wanted to go in front of them. And I said no. So I'm gonna give them space. I'm sure they're fine. Uh, but if I catch up to them, then that gives me a reason. It gives me an excuse to slow down. Okay, so we're back where we were, where we started Gill's Crack, and this goes into Nandingo, I think, which got bulldozed, and then they rebuilt it slightly, so it's not as big as it once was. And then there's stuff afterwards, I think. I don't know. It's been so long. I don't. I don't remember. that up pretty big okay so normally I just ride up this like this is part of my my route for like I'm in shape on my pedal and this isn't difficult but you know you still got pedal upwards so I'm saving myself whatever's next oh the dog pound that's next wow so I guess apparently walking up takes, your, takes some effort I'm going to blame it on 100% humidity 85-ish degrees not much of a breeze Oh, I guess there's a little one. <sighs> so, dog pound. I feel like they built it up a little bit, but they definitely extended it. It goes, well, it goes further than it did. Is that dude running in Yeezys? Oh, uh, well, I guess I have to sit here for a minute because there's a jogger on trail. Like, dude, why didn't you go up? Like, why are you going right over? Oh, I see he skipped some of the jumps. But I predict he's going to go down where the wood thing is. Go up, go up. What the hell? Yep, he went down. Okay, so we will. Yeah, I was trying to text you. You just texted me. Uh, no, I just texted you. I was making footy for the boys. And I was trying to text you. That not boys is just you. But my hands are all sweaty. And my phone screen is all sweaty. And it kept changing different screens. I was like, okay, screw it. Never mind. Just so you know, the plan is for this super sick edit to go up today. Because I'm just going to run all the clips together, make it one. Oh, hell. All right. 
another freaking jogger. Go up, go up, go up. Okay, guys, she's going up, so I'm gonna go ahead and go. Oh. I'm blame that on my foot, not being on the pedal correctly. Couldn't stop because jogger. Okay. Okay, so I do not know what this is called. This trail is like super old. At least I always go this way. I think. But we're only gonna go that way so I can show you. Well what the hell? There's a jump. Whoa. I think it might be my headset if it's squeaking. So, we're doing cross country, you know, obviously, fly through this. But, let's see if we can see it from over here. In the winter, you can see it perfectly fine, but things are growing. Keep out the, the debris. Okay. This is one of the newer features. Kind of go into a valley, go to the left, a little kicker, and then a little creek gap thing. I have not attempted, nor will I today. This is why I've been riding Sugarland, because Where's that e-bike? <sighs> so, typically the route that I would take is I don't even come up here. I just kind of go, well, just can't cut over. But when I come this way, I usually just turn, right? Go this way. So I can avoid that trail. Unless I'm in like get in shape mode. I'm gonna hit every pedally part I can. But we are in survival mode currently. So I always like this part. It's got some flow. Oh. 
entrance to that other tra feature trail. So this is 713, I think. This is all fresh. It's the bottom of the little downhill line. Struggling. So I've never been a fan of this because of the wood landing. I don't know. Okay, I'm walking the 713 back. line is actually connected to the kink berm. So, so you remember the fence line roller things? They're all connected now. Going this way just in case. Jog it around with me. Okay. So there's the. Oh, I guess we'll go over here. It's got a wheel tail. And like a step up. And it was. This used to be a lily pad, but too many people crashed. So they made it not a lily pad. It was also really difficult. And then they made it shorter. So, I don't know how far I'm going to go, because I've been tired. Five miles in, and I'm exhausted already. Feeling like this Dekine jersey maybe isn't so good for summer days. It's definitely thicker than my usual jersey, and I guess with no, no breeze, I'm just... Okay, we'll have to come back to do the kink berm because I'm really, I got no energies. Especially since you got to pedal a whole bunch on that freaking thing. But kink berm, you've seen it before, you've ridden it before. Okay, so this is your Shakira line. And I'm not going to go at speed because I don't know what the jump at the bottom looks like. But we'll, we'll jump right there. Takes you to the wall. It's really weird. And then hustle through here. Normally I'll drop in all the way to the right. So I got like extra speed. Boom! And then, whoosh, oh, it looks pretty good. Land that. And you got this little double roller thing. And you got that. And then, if you have enough speed, you got this. Yeah. Yep. It's fun. I mean, if you like pedaling, this is leading us towards that little beginner little section that had the little little jumps and stuff so over here next to the gully line which I know they built it up but due to energy constraints 
we shall just roll through it. See, like it's way bigger than it once was. Man, here, boom! Rail to burn, boom! Yeah. Golf course finally got around to fixing their drainage. So this is the old exit. Golf course. Dingo slash George Dingo. Which again? Oh my god. I'm doing good. Just staying upright on the bike, I think. Much bigger. Very nice. I guess like double the height it used to be. I'm gonna pass out. Okay, so we found a sick little area where there's a breeze. I guess because the uh, golf course took the trees out over there. So now we got, it's all open. And, uh, I don't think there was a bridge here before, but they like built all, they put all this dirt here. Oh, I'm like sweating all over the camera. So I can't remember if that bridge was out over by the pump track thing, but there's no bridge there now because it's all dirt. It's a dirt bridge. Okay. I think I caught enough breath. So we're just going to roll across the top to where the, uh, what's going to call it, little pump track thing is. Let's see, when the bridge was out, I would have taken that left, which is a nice little descent at speed. Thank you. they lost. Oh, so it's good I didn't go down because there's a dude walking his dog. And I'd have been going fast. But obviously when you go down you got to come back up. So there's no like good up trail from down there. So this is where the bridge used to be. They then got washed out. So we had to go down at the bottom and cross Bayou Creek thing. But now it's all dirt, all the way down. So, you can see that's where they had to close the trail. Dang, that was three or four years ago. Because I remember when uh, the, uh, that thing that happened in 2020, I'd always have to like go down and around. Okay. Pump track. I'm sure, it has a name, but I have no idea. And you've done it before, so there's no need for me to send it. Saving energies. There's a burn there now. Hope nobody comes up behind me and calls me a noob. Yeah, I used to go to it. Oh, did he? Yeah. He's good. He's very good. Very knowledgeable. 
full face. No, I'm going that way. Okay. Yeah, she, uh... So we'll go ahead and roll through the... Really, dude? The guy with the full face did not go through whatever this is called. Oh. oh. This is super sad. Oh, maybe I'll just like, speed up the footage. Whoa. Whoa, check out the whip. Whoa. Uh, not really sure what I'm saving my energy for at this point. Oh yeah, kink farm. Right, is that the only thing that's left to do? Hmm. Well, I guess saving up energy to be able to actually pedal back to the parking lot. Yeah. I don't know. Okay, so that was everything going that direction. I'm trying to think if there's... I mean, the kink from is really kind of the only thing going this way. Oh, Gil's crack is going this way, but we already did that. Okay, well that... I guess we'll add another clip or two in here and then we'll call it Finito. Most exciting YouTube video ever made. Okay, it's real. I remember now there's... Not only the kink berm, which I'm debating on whether I want to go that way, but then we got like the downhill line. Oh, that's so fun. Oh wait, I guess we could do both. Oh, freaking mud. Why? Why do you want to run on this? I got the full face still in front of me. They're taking the easiest routes possible. Mm. Okay. This will get back up to the top. Yep. Oh, I guess you can just hang on. Hold on a second. We're almost the up part. Squeak, squeak. Let's see. Not that one. Here we go. Oh. I like this route. It takes you up the back side of the secure wall, or hip, or whatever. Don't need a knee bike. You just had a shape, dude. Hmm. Okay. Here we go. Oh. Clear back. Not enough energies. And she'll pause. I mean, it's kind of ridiculous how hot this feels to me. I'm sure it's, I mean, it's hot. It's probably 90 now. 
but like man the humidity on top of the heat oh geez good morning Pretty close together. a little bit yep a little bit toasty what's special about the water bottle because I feel like Waterburger sells water, bo water bottles and they're probably not well maybe they are fifteen dollars okay so now we gotta wait for the guy and his dog yeah you because know, I'm such a hurry to go well, are we looking straight down I think this might be, I can't think of any other features after this, other than Gills Crack, which we're not going to do, because I already did it. Yeah, yep, pretty much, that's it. I think I already said that. Okay, here we go. The downhill line. Oh. Kind of scared me. Let's see, do we want to go up or down? No, the guy with the dog is down, so we will go up. Oh, wrong gear. The battery died, or if that last clip is too long. It's weird. I don't know if I set a limit, but uh, okay, there's really nothing left to see. So maybe we'll put the other battery in or something and capture the roll back to the car. Okay, so I guess. It was too hot. The GoPro kept turning off, so I don't know what um, what the uh, last clip was, but uh, it's hot and I'm out of shape. So I hope you enjoyed the uh, walkthrough, basically, of the Anthills 2023. I'm bringing a towel. This is gonna suck. Okay. Well, I guess I'll go home and edit this and oh it's father's day so happy father's day laters